In the vast and dynamic realm of military aviation, one aircraft stands out for its sheer power, versatility, and decades-long service to the United States Marine Corps. The CH-53 E Super Stallion. This three-engine helicopter has been the workhorse of the Marine Corps for over 40 years, earning its reputation as the heaviest helicopter in the U.S. military. As we bid farewell to this iconic aircraft, we delve into its remarkable history, capabilities, and evolution leading to its successor, the CH-53 K King Stallion, the workhorse of the Marine Corps. A symbol of relief, Captain Peter Nierheim, an instructor pilot with Marine Heavy Helicopter Training Squadron 302, encapsulates the essence of the CH-53 E Super Stallion as the Marine Corps' heavy lift asset and the unsung hero of Marine Corps aviation. For over four decades, it has served as a symbol of relief for troops on the ground, signifying the arrival of essential supplies or a swift departure from the theater of operations. Versatility. Unmatched. The CHE 53E's versatility is its hallmark. With a capacity to lift Humvees, artillery, and a myriad of cargo, it has been the linchpin in combat support since 1981. Its capability to execute fast rope landings, troop insertions, and extractions has been pivotal in numerous operations, including the historic air assault in Marja, Afghanistan in February 2010. This heavy lift powerhouse has time and again proven its mettle in diverse scenarios. Humanitarian missions. Beyond its combat role, the CH-53E has been a beacon of hope in humanitarian missions. In the aftermath of major disasters, it has ferried thousands of pounds of food and relief supplies, embodying the Marine Corps' commitment to global service and aid. Technical marvels and specifications. Design. Excellence. Designed to transport up to 55 troops or 32,000 pounds of cargo internally. The CH-53E's robust design is powered by three General Electric T-64 GE416 turboshaft engines. Mounted above the main cabin, these engines transmit power to the rotors through a complex system of gears and shafts, enabling this heavy lift giant to achieve a top speed of approximately 170 knots. Defensive capabilities. Originally armed with .50 caliber machine guns, the CH-53E evolved to counter vulnerabilities. The introduction of the ramp-mounted weapon system, RMWS, featuring the M3M.50 caliber machine gun, enhanced its defensive capabilities. Additionally, chaff and flare dispensers were integrated to thwart potential threats. Noteworthy upgrades. Over the years, the CH-53E underwent various upgrades, including improvements in avionics, mine hunting equipment, and increased engine power. These enhancements not only extended its operational life, but also ensured it remained at the forefront of technological advancements in military aviation. Notable incidents and the shadow of tragedy. A bittersweet legacy. The CH-53E Super Stallion, like any military aircraft, has faced its share of challenges. The tragic crash in Al-Anbar province, Iraq, in 2005, resulting in the loss of 31 lives, stands as a somber reminder of the inherent risks of military aviation. The crash landing in Okinawa in 2017 due to an engine fire further emphasizes the complexities and dangers faced by those who operate such formidable machines. Balancing Act. Success amidst tragedy. While these incidents cast a shadow, it's crucial to acknowledge the countless successful missions and critical contributions made by the CH-53E Super Stallion throughout its service. It has been a steadfast ally in the Marine Corps' endeavors, demonstrating resilience even in the face of adversity. The CH-53 K King Stallion, a worthy successor. Evolution in progress. As the curtains close on the CH-53E Super Stallion, the stage is set for its successor, the CH-53K King Stallion. This newer, more advanced version is not merely a replacement. It represents a leap into the future of heavy lift aviation. Technological leap. The CH-53K boasts 57% more horsepower, 63% fewer parts, and the ability to lift three times more than its predecessor. 
The introduction of full authority fly-by-wire flight controls and advanced stability augmentation elevates it to a level of sophistication that enhances both safety and operational efficiency. Aligning with Marine Corps' vision, the CH-53K aligns seamlessly with the Marine Corps Force Design 2030 update. Its capabilities complement existing assets, facilitating enhanced maneuverability in lateral areas and ensuring that the Marine Corps remains at the forefront of heavy lift aviation capabilities. In the grand tapestry of military aviation, the CH-53E Super Stallion concludes a significant chapter, leaving behind a legacy etched in strength, service, and sacrifice. Its retirement marks the end of an era, but the story of the Marine Corps' commitment to excellence and innovation continues with the advent of the CH-53 K King Stallion. As we bid farewell to this venerable heavy lift helicopter, let us not only honor its storied history, but also anticipate the heights that the CH-53 K King Stallion will undoubtedly reach. The transition is not merely a changing of the guard, it's a testament to the relentless pursuit of advancement and the unwavering dedication of the United States Marine Corps to maintaining air superiority in the face of evolving challenges. The CH-53 E Super Stallion's roar may fade into the echoes of history, but its impact reverberates, shaping the narrative of military aviation for generations to come. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey into the world of the CH-53 E Super Stallion the backbone of the United States Marine Corps for over four decades. If you enjoyed this deep dive, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more insightful content. Stay tuned for future updates on military aviation, and until next time, fly high and stay curious.